1 Preparation Gather supplies, 4 Catheter, Tourniquet, Antiseptic Swabs, Gauze, Transparent Dressing, 4 Tubing Slash Connector, Saline Flush, Gloves and Tape Check Equipment, Ensure the catheter's packaging is intact and the other supplies are sterile 2 Patient Preparation Explain the procedure, clearly describe the process to the patient to reduce anxiety. Position the patient, make sure the patient is comfortable, with the arm extended and supported. Apply the tourniquet, place it a few inches above the intended insertion site. Ensure it's tight enough to make the veins visible but not too tight to cause discomfort. 3. Selecting the insertion site. Choose a suitable vein. Look for veins that are straight, easily visible, and feel firm but not hard. Common sites are the forearm and the back of the hand. Avoid problematic areas, steer clear of areas with bruises, scars, signs of infection, or previous four sites. For insertion technique. Clean the site, use an antiseptic swab to clean the site in a circular motion, moving from the center outward. Allow it to dry. Glove up. Put on sterile gloves. Anchor the vein, use your non-dominant hand to gently stretch the skin below the insertion site to stabilize the vein. Insert the needle, hold the catheter at a 15 to 30 degree angle to the skin. Insert the needle with a quick, steady motion until you see a flash of blood in the chamber. Advance the catheter, once you see the flash, carefully advance the catheter into the vein while withdrawing the needle. Secure the catheter. Remove the tourniquet. Apply pressure above the insertion site to prevent bleeding while removing the needle completely. Attach the four tubing slash connector to the catheter hub. 5. Secure and test the four. Flush the line, use a saline flush to ensure the four is patent and not leaking. Apply the dressing, secure the four site with a transparent dressing, ensuring the catheter hub is covered. Tape the tubing. Use tape to secure the tubing, creating a loop to reduce tension on the catheter. 6. Post-insertion care. Check for complications, observe for signs of infiltration, phlebitis, or extravasation. Document the procedure, record the insertion site, time, catheter gauge, and any other relevant information in the patient's chart. Tips for success. Stay calm. Keep a steady hand and remain calm during the procedure. Use a vein finder, if veins are difficult to locate, a vein finder can be helpful. Communicate with the patient, reassure the patient and let them know what you are doing at each step. Adjust the angle, if you don't see a flash, try adjusting the angle slightly before removing the needle and attempting again.